All right. Now, before I get to my big idea, I got a big idea, but I got a couple things to say. First off, to on response to a couple of people that commented on my Madden collection, on one of my Madden collection update videos, I have looked in GameStop for Madden 09 and Madden 10, and I found both games, and both for the systems I need them for, which is PS2 and Xbox 360, and also. I have looked on eBay for Madden 2005 Collector's Edition, and I have found one that works, presumably. But I haven't found, I haven't looked for Madden 01 yet. I'll probably do that tomorrow, because I got um, I'm actually got a day off tomorrow because it's uh, DJ work day. And on the subject of, if you guys remember Tim Tebow's big hit, um, that he got drilled against Kentucky, I think last night, on Saturday night or whenever it was, I don't remember exactly when it was, but he got absolutely drilled. If you don't know what happened, there's a bunch of YouTube videos on there. I've got one of my favorites, not because I don't, not because I hate Tim Tebow, but just because it was a gruesome hit, and I kind of wanted, you know, just as a moment, I don't know, I, I, I don't, I'm not trying to be mean by putting into my favorites like, oh, I hate Tim Tebow. Just in case, you know, someone needs, like, a link to it or something, I put it there, and I'm not trying to, like, not trying to, like, hate Florida or anything, so, just, I put it in there if you guys wanted to see it. So, if you guys wanted to see the hit, there it is. If you don't, if you don't know what happened, he got drilled by a defensive end, and then he hit his, as he was falling down, his knee hit the back of, here's his head, his knee hit the back of somebody's, or his head hit the like the back of his head hit by somebody's knee, and he got drilled. Thankfully, he was okay. It looks to be just a concussion. So, my best wishes to Tim Tebow, and hopefully he gets better, because he's one of my personal favorites. Um, hope he gets better. Anywho, um, I've got a big idea. I didn't draft a fantasy football team this year, so what I'm gonna do. It's going to be kind of ghetto, but you'll kind of get this. I'm going to have my own little fantasy football game for each year, or for each week. I'm going to sort of, I guess, draft my own team of one quarter of one primary quarterback. And I haven't worked that specific yet, but it's going to be a, most likely just one starting quarterback, but it could be one starting quarterback and one backup. One starting quarterback, a running back, most likely a fullback. But probably not one quarterback, one running back, one fullback, three wide receivers, offensive linemen don't count here. And then on defense, I mean with an option for a tight end or two receivers and a tight end, depending on how I want to do it. And then on defense I will draft three defensive linemen and three defensive backs. Just people that I think are gonna do well this week. I guess you know, just depending on looking at the matchups. And then, at the end, I will tally all the points and see how I did. Okay? And see what I, you know, see what I could have done. It's kind of ghetto, but I'll figure out the details later. Offense, here's how the scoring is going to work. Touchdown is five points um, for any of the players. Every 25, no, every 10 yards is one point. Interceptions are minus two. Lost fumbles are minus two. And if the quarterback has a 300 yard game, it's three points. If the wide receiver gets a 100 yard game, or if the running back has a 100 yard game, it's three points. If the running back has a 200 yard game, it's five points. If the wide receiver gets a 200 yard game, because wide receivers tend to get, it's ten, it's harder for wide receivers to get. 100 yard games then generally um you know running backs cuz running backs will generally you kind of understand that it'll be 7 points on 7 points see that there we go it's, i'm kind of working out the details on it but let me know what you think and i'll try and you know tweak the system a little bit um that's it yeah thank you and good night